All right, we're set now, folks. Now it definitely works. I checked on the other system, and it's definitely at the right size and everything. So, let's restart like nothing ever happened, all right? All right, here we go. So we'll answer our phone as we lay there face down on the floor. Did you just, were you just thrown out of a plate glass window? No. Hey, well, I work at the gun cro company across the road, man. I just saw someone get thrown out of your apartment window. I don't want to talk about it. Actually, I was going to call you about something else, but now I'm more interested in this. Well, just try to move on. What do you need? My name's Selena Delgado. My boss, Rook, says you're some kind of freelance spy, and I might have a job for you. Want to come up? Ah, sure, buzz me in. So we'll go ahead and go upstairs, using the stairs, oddly enough. Who the hell is that? Well, shit. Well, I guess we won't be seeing her now. Gotta wait for the elevator. Takes forever. Well, in case it's not already obvious, long field <laughs> falls don't kill you. So let's just demonstrate this. Blop. We just belly flop right onto the ground. Now, since we had so much uh, technical difficulties earlier, I'm actually going to go into this again. Why no 1080p? Because it's good. Well, it's mostly because I'm not a partner there, buddy. But anyway. And also, I don't want to crush everyone's connections. Well, the things in this is you can grip to the ceiling and walls with ease. I think that's a new feature I just did there. You usually couldn't do that. Anyway, let's just go follow that guy. 57 seconds earlier. Congratulations on purchasing your new Bullfrog brand hyper trousers. Caution, at maximum strength, a, jo a jump may shatter glass ceilings, windows, and children. Glass children. Outdoor use only. Hmm. Well, I'm going to try them anyway. They work. Now we can get started with this again. And let's see. Conway, this is Melanie Rook. Selene Delgado worked for me. Do you have time to talk? I suppose I do. I don't... I know you didn't kill Selena. I watched the footage. You walked right in front of the security camera on your way to Selena's office after the shots were fired. But the East Point police won't look beyond an easy conviction. That footage puts you right at the crime scene, and I have to turn it over to him. Why do you even care? Selena was my friend. I want her real killer to be caught. In fact, I want him dead. But once he's in a jail cell, <clears throat> once he's in a jail cell, that becomes simpler to achieve. I have to hand the footage over if I have it. Let's make sure I don't have it. I've wiped my copy, but my camera feeds get backed up to data centers at five different off-site locations. If you can wipe out them all, you're free and clear and the police will have to find the real killer. Why can't you just wipe it remotely? I mean, you have SSH, right? If you could wipe it remotely, there wouldn't be any point in storing it remotely. Head to the DataSec facility at Port Heath, and I'll make sure that the front door is open, and... I'll make sure that the front door open is open, but you'll have to take it from there. And she is disconnected. Hmm... Let's see if everyone's having a good time. Make sure the stream is uh, going all right. It looks like it's pretty good. Uh-huh. Okay, good. <laughs> you love this game, Bryden Suki? This is the first time I've ever played it. I've seen it played before. So let's see. Rook, caught on camera. I'm guessing this is our, like, mission uh, readout right here. The footage of you at the murder scene has automatically been backed up in five different locations. This is the closest. Get there and wipe the data. I'm guessing we get 30 bucks. <laughs> She's paying us to clear our name. That's not bad at all. Yeah, those are our missions. Here's the shop. 
We can get a crosslink. Rewire electronic devices. That sounds pretty sweet. Wire jack. Rewire secure circuits. Drop shot. Land silently from any height. Death fluke. Some incoming, some incoming shots might miss. Hushcracker. Muffle breaking glass. That sounds pretty sweet. It's also extremely expensive. Prank spasm. Booby trap electronics. Long shot. We will rewire enemy guns. That's a new feature. And revolver. You actually get a handgun to fight back. And let's see. We also have upgrades. Bullfrog jump strength increases both speed and distance traveled. Bullfrog charge up time, which I really didn't have a problem with yet. Hmm. And it makes it charge up more quickly. Okay. Of course, we have no money now, so let's just get to it, folks. On the top floor of this building, there's a bank of servers with a computer nearby. If you can get to that, you can wipe the evidence that you were at our offices when Selena was killed. Of course, I didn't really mention it before, but you cannot not walk in front of that camera. So let's see, how do I get in? I've had one of our tech guys open the front door for you. Their electronic systems are hackable from there, but for obvious reasons, their servers are not. How do I wipe the data? I've seen your record. This will be well within your abilities. Once you're in, the scrubber script I'm sending you will auto-wipe anything from today's date ending with MPEG-4. It's just like a shell script with a find and execute, right? I got it. Let's get started. Make sure everything's still going well. Yeah, it looks good. He is not the best spy if everyone bloody well knows he does. Yeah, I know, right? Hold down the left mouse to aim your jump. At the moment of full strength, uh -huh. and yeah, I can adjust my jumping with the mouse. You can see, well, you might not be able to see this as clearly as I'd want to, because we're only in 720p and this game only plays at 1080, but here we go. Up. Go ahead and climb up. It doesn't seem like there's much of a problem here. We can just jump right up there, right? I don't have the strength. Well, shoot. I'm going to have to go around the long way. If I had stronger bullfrog trousers, I could just, you know, go through the windows. So now I'm in the front door. Doesn't seem to be anything too crazy in here. There's no guards or anything. So I guess I'll just ride the elevator up to the top floor. I noticed that the elevators stop at every floor, which is sort of weird. So here's the secure terminal. I guess I'll press W to hack. There we go. Main objectives complete. Let's head to the subway and get the fuck out of here. I could break through the window, but that'd be leaving evidence, folks. At least I think it would be. Anyway, first mission complete. Let's see, I was a gentleman. I guess I have a violence meter here. I guess it's sort of like Hitman, actually. Witnesses? There were no witnesses. I was a ghost. Noise? I didn't break the glass. I think that would have probably changed that, so I was a ninja. And of course, time. Laptops? There's a laptop in there? Hmm. Can I replay it so I can get that laptop? No? Good job. Well, not particularly. I missed a laptop. Our feeds are backed up in four more facilities. The others are slightly better guarded. Well, I'd hope so. But there's nothing too tax taxing there. I'll give you the addresses in the order of security, since frankly I have no idea how good you are. <laughs> and also the game is better paced that way. That's a slightly creepy level of micromanagement, but alright. You'll see a mission briefing for a job on the... Proudmoor Drive. Take it. So here we have a guarded one. This one pays a little better. Let's see, can I buy upgrades? I, oh yeah, I just got upgrade points. I have two available. So I could get more jumps. I think I, should I get more jumps? I think I will go with more jumps. Hops are always good, right? I don't have enough money for anything. This will be handy soon, so that'll probably be the first thing I get. 
So you make sure everything's still going in. I'm not too far at all, Strutdan. I just got done with essentially the first mission, so you're <laughs> you arrived at just the right time. So let's go ahead and get our next mission. The Westfield facility has better security than the previous. My guys open the front door for you. Of course, we can't have your guy do all of this shit because it'd be too damn convenient. Anyway, my, di my guys open the front door for you, but the door to the server room is secure. Two guards are working tonight. Whoever is in the server room can probably open the door to it. So get him to do it for you. Hmm. Isn't that kind of the opposite of a guard's job description? It is. These guys spend more time dealing with electronic faults than professional spies, though. It shouldn't be too hard to outwit them. Yep, so there's one of them. There's another guy. Are there any laptops inside? I think that's a laptop right there. I'm not exactly sure I'm going to do this. So here we have one dude. He's looking squarely at the door. Is there anything I can do to stop him? George, uh, George, guards will shoot on sight. Circ uh, the cursor turns red in areas that uh, guards can see. So right here, you'll see that it turns red. Jump on the guard to pin him to the ground. I guess I could just do that. Use my bullfrog trousers. Bounce. And then I'll punch him. Punch. 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 Okay, he's good. <laughs> And we'll go ahead and head downstairs. That's a bit more violent than I'd like to be. And here's a secondary objective, a laptop with private data you can steal. Okay, let's see. Where's this say? From Julian Mayfield, Chief of Police. Apparently this is his... No, wait, no, this is going to someone else. For some reason, there's a police department laptop here. So this is the East Point Police Department. Oh, subject, swapping weapons. Getting sick of saying this, so I'll keep it brief. All police issue firearms are bomb print coded to their owner. Similar to the way it was in Metal Gear Solid 4 or something like it. It was sort of like that. They were like genetically co coded, but either way. If you take or borrow someone else's gun, it will not fire. We're seeing far too many snob foos like Friday. Perps getting away because an officer was using a borrowed weapon or one stolen from evidence. Wait, the ones in evidence are palm-coded too? <laughs> the criminals are using palm-coded guns? This is dumb. Anyway, if you lose your sidearm, which seems to happen more than I'd like than I can fully comprehend, just report it. I'm waiving the fee for replacement. I need your <laughs> you need a gun that works, goddammit. Chief Mayfield. Okay, well, we have this guy here. He can see... He can't see on the other side of the door. So what do you want me to do? Only guards can use the red hand scanners. In the dark... Oh, I see. The guards will look for a light switch. The guards can't see that far in the dark. So now here he comes. He's got his gun up. Punch! Punch, 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 punch. Okay, he's good. And now I'll hack... And we're good. A little more violent than I would have liked, but I don't really have the stuff I'd need to make it less violent. Anyway, we'll keep, we'll turn off the lights. You know, save some power. Sam Fisher would approve, right? Yeah, it was... I had witnesses? I guess they did see my face when I was punching them to death. But still, an A-plus rating. Not bad. Take a look at the chat now while I have a break and have a drink. Leave gentlemanly stuff for Trilby. <laughs> I guess that's right, Applejack. <laughs> Turns off lights, runs across the street. I think that man was Captain Planet. <laughs> so, let's see. And now we have our next mission already, it would seem. Crossed wires. To get to Ellis, to the, into the Ellis Street facility, you'll need to rewire some of the building's electronics. If you don't have Crosslink, buy one. So, it wants us to buy this. I think that's probably a good idea. We have one for upgrading. We'll go ahead and get another uh, bullfrog jump strength. Maximum strength jumps. I can't open the server room door on Ellis Street. There's no guards working tonight, though. You'll have to do it yourself. Hmm, no guards, huh? Seems easy enough. 
Oh, also we have case notes. I didn't notice that. A pers uh, prospective client, Selena Delgado, was shot and killed in her office. Yeah, this is all the stuff we saw before. We already know all this. Anyway, no problem. I think I know how to get in there. So, let's see. Switch the crosslink mode with the uh, mouse wheel or alt. How do I do it? Oh, yeah, here we are. Click and drag a line from any device to link it with another. If you can... If you link a switch to a door, the switch will open the door. Direction matters. Linking them the other way won't do anything. Hmm. I thought she said that this door would not open. It's clearly open. Huh. Hmm. Well, whatever. I didn't do jack shit, but here's another laptop. Another... Another message from the Chief of Police, Chief Mayfield. We're getting more and more reports of electronics in these post-millennial buildings behaving strangely. Lights going out, and also more serious stuff like electronic doors suddenly swinging open. If you see anything like that, please put in your report. Play it safe. Those doors opened way too fast. And there's no light switch down here, so I can't turn off the lights. Unless... Let's see. Oh, no I can't because these ones don't even have like lines. So, we have this door that's locked. So I'll go ahead and take this. Am I doing it right? Maybe like that? I don't know how to disconnect that. Maybe like... I... Oh, I see. There we go. So now it should work. Now I just go and press up here. And... The door opens. It sort of spasm there for a second, but we got it. Not a freaking problem. So we will get out. Also, I want to turn off the lights. That's weird that... Huh. I like fucked up the lights. Well, whatever. Let's get out of here. And we'll try not to break the glass. Try to leave as little evidence as we can, right folks? Thoughtful time? Is that good? I got like the best rank you can get on that one. <laughs> but honestly, these missions really aren't that aren't that hard. Oh, I get it, Millie Bay's direction matters. I probably had to drag it from the switch to the uh, to the light. I gotcha. So now we have our next mission. We're almost done with this whole uh, string of missions already. The next the next terminals on Loxley Loxley close. By the way, be careful with main outlets. They'll emit a shock if you crosslink something with them. Hmm. I see. That could be handy. Can I buy anything? No. I'm a goddamn peasant. Let's upgrade our hops. There we got. We got more hops. And we'll just get into the next mission. Oh, I don't even get any sort of uh, intro here. So I could pounce on that guy. Here's the computer we need. I don't see any laptops in this one. Unless that's it. I don't think so, though. Hmm. I'm trying to devise ways where I will not have to interact with the guards, but I don't think that's possible. It's actually... There are plenty of switches. And I might be able to get him to do something if I turn off the lights. I don't know how I do that though. I don't have any control of any other switches, other than that one. Let's just bounce on this guy and punch him. Punch, 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 punch. And let's see. What should I do with you, sir? I could probably get up there without any much fuss. So if I go up here, there we go. I can turn off his lights easy enough. Whoop. Let's just connect this also. Let's see, I can connect a main outlet to that. Where's the main outlet? Is this one? Let's go ahead and disconnect that. I said, let's disconnect that. I can't. Whoop. There we go. So I'll connect mine up here. So now he should go over here, touch this, and he should get electrocuted. Right? Nope. He's just gonna stay pissed off. Let's see if I can do this completely stealth-like. Like it's a stealth game or something, right, folks? 
might hear me when I fall down. Nope. Like a goddamn ninjas. Hup. Mm -hmm. And he didn't even know I was there. Just as I planned it. Now let's go ahead and switch this over here. Oh. No hopping. There you go. We actually kept one alive tonight, folks. Not terrible. I had one witnesses because I punched him. Non-lethal. Yeah, I didn't punch that guy to death. I wonder if it actually factors in the number of punches you give him. <laughs> oh no. Who who knows? Let's see, I feel sp Let's see, Pilgrim Lee says, I feel that the spy is a man after Lethal's own heart. Solve problems with his fists. And science! The science of punching things! I still don't have enough money for buying things. That's a shame. We'll just upgrade our hops. Our hops and our barley. Three for all. The last one and you're clear. The data sec place on Gershwin and Forth is the biggest and most heavily guarded. But after this, there's no more evidence linking you to Selena's murder. Let's get in there and get it fixed. This is the last facility with a copy of the footage. But it's stored on three different servers. You'll need to get to those three different terminals and hack each one. Let's see, are you seeing anyone about your backup addiction? It's really, really, uh, well, concerning. We need an, we need an intervention. Well, you never know when a suspected murderer is going to go and try and systematically <laughs> going to try systematically erasing them. Well, that is a fair point. Good luck, she says. All right. So let's see what we're dealing with. Here we are, of course. We have a camera on this one. And we have one guard, two guards, three guards. He can actually see outside pretty far, too. He can almost see down here. Let's see, where are the servers? Here are the terminals. Oh, there's another guy right there. He's probably watching some YouTube right now. At least that's what I like to imagine. So here, I think, is where we can enter. Yeah. No one's looking down here. Let's go. Just hop right here. Up. What are we looking at on the other side? Got some interesting stuff in there. I have access to one switch. There's an outlet. Power outlet. When activated, knocks out nearby guards. So is it not activated? Huh. Weird. So I could probably get rid of him pretty easily. Let's actually just try shocking everybody. So let's go ahead and turn on that outlet. I hope this is how it works. Otherwise, I'm going to shock myself and it's going to be stupid. Will you get off there? Hey! Hey! Stop it! Ah, I see. So that's how that works. Okay, I gotcha. Hmm. Well, now that I know how that works, that makes that a little simpler. Now, if I could go like that, he might shock himself there when he tries to turn it on, right? Let's try it. So he goes over there, he tries to turn it on. It didn't work. That's a shame. Well, I can fix that. I'll fix your wagon. Zap. Okay, that worked perfectly. Now for you, my friend. There's no... Hmm. I wonder if I... Is it this simple to turn these off? It sure is. Huh. Well, that's easy. There's no more outlets. He's the only easy one to get rid of. So I guess I'll just turn off their lights. Let's disconnect this. Make this here. And I'll go in there like... Well, like I'm a goddamn spy. Oh boy. Oh, I went the wrong way. That guy's not even watching. That is not a problem. This guy is a problem, though. Mm -hmm. Get the computer. GTFO. We'll go up. Not a problem at all. Oh, I didn't see you in there, you little shit. Okay, so we have access to another switch here. How can we get rid of you? I could make a little noise and jump in through that window. I think I will try that, just for a little variety. 
I'm not going for the ooh, the super high uh, score here. How? He might actually try to come down the elevator there too, which would be amusing. It's actually come on. God. It's a little awkward to switch between the modes here, folks. Let's go ahead and switch this to here. This should get both of them moving. What is that one connected to? Let's disconnect that one too. I'm gonna try to lock them both over here in this room. Let's disconnect these. And that guy's not moving. Can you actually see? He can see out in front of him. Hmm. If I went in there, he'd start shooting. And I can't jump through the window because that'd kind of piss him off. Just gonna get, give you guys a head up, heads up. Let's go ahead and open this door. There we go. I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try jumping through the window onto the ceiling. Hello. <laughs> Not exactly how I planned it. I guess I didn't have enough uh, vertical velocity. How am I gonna get you away from there, you little shit? Let's turn on the lights again, I guess. Whoop. Since he can see me in there, maybe he actually can't see that far? Let's actually... Let's see, folks. Will he start shooting? He actually did not start shooting. He cannot see. How close can he see? <laughs> he tried to shoot me, little dickens. Stop that. Okay, not the cleanest getaway. Any laptops before we leave? Yep, there's one. We do not want to leave those fuckers behind. So I'm going to pick that shit up. I need that paper. Well, you could have the elevator already. I don't think there's any more in here, so I'll pick you up. Another message from the chief of police. Cameras don't hate black people. I didn't expect a headline or a subject like that. Let's see, we need to put the rest, this idiotic rumor that our security suffered <laughs> detecting dark-skinned people as intruders. They don't. What they do is analyze the subject's face, stature, movement characteristics, and match them against our database of known security personnel. That means if anyone who isn't police or private security walks in front of a camera, regardless of skin color, it will trigger. If it's connected, our if it's connected to an alarm, it will be set off. If not, it adds a note to the footage uh, for security for later review. Whether you're con whether they're connected to anything or not, all of our cameras store their feeds. So if you or, for example, pull an African American uh, transient in off the street into a secure facility and shove him in front of a security camera with. In a misguided attempt to prove <laughs> this piece of software is racist, we have footage of you doing it. <laughs> Fascinating. Anyway. Them and their racist bullshit. Let's get the fuck out of here. I've wasted enough time. Whee! Uh, pretty good. I actually had pretty good time on that, considering. Or actually, no, that's just... That's actually not good. I see. Well, whatever. We did a good job. It doesn't affect my money, either. It's not a bad rating at all. Well, I think that concludes our business. There's nothing left that links you to Selena's murder. So the East, Pol East Point Police are going to have to look a little harder. If they don't find him, I will. And if they do, I know exactly where he is. I appreciate your help, whatever the reasons. Well, actually, then what? What happens then? I have a medical degree and a gun company. Okay. He's going to find... Let's see. He's going to find out why it makes a bad idea to kill someone I like. And then she disconnects after that. A medical degree and a gun company. Hmm. I see. Actually, I don't see. I'm completely confused.